Hello everyone. Well, once again, welcome to our uh, Joomla tutorial. So this uh, video is uh, uh, all about installing an extension for Joomla 4 and uh, how to uninstall extension. So it's a very basic, uh, very basic uh, tutorial. But uh, uh, what we are doing right here is uh, to show you how it works for Joomla 4. So let's try and go ahead. Uh, let's try install one of our extensions so uh, we do have an extensions if you have time you can visit our portfolio at uh, wedevelops.com so we specialize in Joomla and OpenCart and uh, this is the extension that we will try sticky bar horizontal module so uh, what is the purpose for this uh, extension well uh, it will show you up some eye-catchy you can use it for your marketing or your uh, announcement uh, to make it easier uh, for the for the browsers or the users to view the link okay so let's assume we have download this one so let's uh, try and uh, install it so uh, he, this is the main uh, Joomla for administrator dashboard so if we install an extensions we go through system and then uh, in this uh, category here it's uh, install so let's uh, check this extension so let's assume we download uh, the extensions uh, that we have so I, I, I have it here so let's uh, just drag it here this is a uh, manual installations where well, you can use also URL folder and uh, install from the web this is uh, in the extension uh, Joomla extension.org so now it says installation of the module was successful so let's go ahead and activate this module since this is a module so normally we go through here system and then uh, let's go and uh, to the category manage so let's click uh, extensions and then uh, after clicking the extensions uh, it says uh, sticky bar this is the one that we install so uh, let's clear that out because uh, I tried to install that el earlier so let's uh, clear that out to see all the extensions right here yeah so let's go back again through here just uh, to show you how it works as a beginner so click module uh, and this is the one that we installed so sticky bar horizontal so let's try to activate that one uh, the menu I went earlier was to uninstall because I tried it er earlier before the video so that's why we go through here but uh, let's try to uh, uh, activate this uh, extension so I will not show the title of course I need to publish it to show it in the front end and I want to put this in the main tab so that uh, it will display in the topmost so I just put here text Joomla 4 and uh, the link is our on our main website just an example you can put any link you want here and uh, you can also uh, show uh, how it works so I'll just put it in the same window and we put uh, uh, this is a demo on how to install and 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 install Joomla for extensions all right uh, then uh, we'll just leave it uh, as default uh, for now so let's try I uh, go ahead and save this one so once it's saved we can go and check in the front end 
uh, if it is working or not. Oh, we forgot to put an assignment uh, of the page. So let, let, let's go ahead and uh, open this first. Uh, see, there's no page, so uh, you can choose which page you want to display actually. But in this case, I put it in all pages and advance and you can change anything up here but for now I will leave it as a default and also the same as permission you don't need uh, anything to change here and let's go ahead and save it again and <clears throat> now it is all saved and let's go ahead and check it in the front end Yeah, so uh, as you can see, we have some red color in here. We change the color to red uh, for the default of Joomla 4. Uh, you can upload any color you want or any picture you want. We do have also module, separate module for this one. But uh, in this scenario, this is the one that we have tried. Uh, see this one? We can hide this. We can show it. So uh, it's... Uh, really eye-catchy you can use it in your marketing or you, you have a announcement so whatever purpose you have so if you click this one this one you can customize whatever text you want to put it here so this is the one that we put Joomla 4 button and it will goes uh, if we click that one it will open this to our main site that uh, we have set up earlier all right so let's uh, click back uh, right now uh, I'll just uh, hit the button just uh, to show you that it was working for the redirect of uh, the link so this is uh, this is it now now what the next thing I would need to show you is how to uninstall this one so we go and try to uninstall this one which go back to the administrator page let's close this one and then uh, we need to go to the system actually to uninstall this one so Joomla 4 is the latest version that was released uh, actually so uh, if you can remember I went to this uh, extension earlier uh, because uh, it was uh, an installation procedure but now let's uh, try to go back here for the extension because we need to uninstall something so if you can see uh, I searched earlier sticky so but if I clear that out uh, you will see all extensions uh, clear that out and hit enter see so this is the uh, all uh, extensions that you can manage for Joomla but uh, the one that we install is a sticky module so you, you can easily type it here sticky and click search and then it will give you the result of the sticky bar and let's just uh, click this one since this is the only one and click uninstall are you sure yes uh, now it's it will say uh, it was unsuccessful because uh, if you can see there's no more search uh, sticky here so just check on the front end it should not showing because it was uh, uninstalled ah yeah so it functions correctly so let's go back to the uh, Joomla backend so th that is how it works uh, how you install an extension for Joomla and how to uninstall the extension in Joomla so once again if you like to have that uh, module you can uh, go to our main website it's redevelops.com uh, you will found and you can download it here you can check in the category Joomla extensions uh, so we have some uh, pretty tools that you can use in your development so uh, that is how it works so yeah so there you go
thank you for watching and uh, let's see you once again in our future videos. Thank you and uh, goodbye for now.